Hello, it's me again. So this is literally like the fourth video that I filmed in five days. It was only five days ago that I filmed my um, update video, although I am staggering the uploads, so you're not gonna get an overdose of me. This video is a bit different. As I have said in my previous few videos, I'm gonna do a question and answer video. And instead of just saying, hey, ask me questions, I thought that I would do a video answering some random questions um, of two YouTube tags that I found. So that's what I've done. One of them is just a random tag that I found and the other one is a Disney tag because you all know that I love Disney. And I just thought it'd be um, a fun way of getting to know a little bit more about me. What's a nickname only your family call you? I don't really have a nickname as such, but something that I was called when I was younger by my brother was Polly Parsnip D Bobby Ingrid, which is... Sorry, I've got the hiccups. Does anyone else get that fear when they have the hiccups that they're never gonna go away? Yeah, Polly Parsnip D Bobby Ingrid. Polly Parsnip because I played Popsy Parsnip in a pantomime once. D because I got a D in music when I was in reception. Why was I graded in reception? I don't know. Bobby because I had a bob and Ingrid because my brother just had it Ingrid on the end. And he used to sing it to the tune of Chitty Bang Bang Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. So Polly Parsnip, D Bobby Ingrid. Polly Parsnip, D Bobby Ingrid. What's a weird habit of yours? Um, I chew straws, that's weird. I literally chew them to the point where I get halfway through the drink and I can't suck anymore. So I have to get a new straw. I used to be able to brush my feet with my hair. That's the wrong way around. I used to be able to brush my hair with my feet. If I, I could grip, I've got like monkey feet. Or I had monkey feet when I could move them. And I could grip a hairbrush with my feet, like with my toes and brush my hair because I'm like really, really bendy. Do you have any weird phobias? I have like OCD phobias, but that's kind of different. Fish, that's a weird phobia. I've never eaten fish in my life, but actually physical fish, seeing fish, I'm terrified of. Um, like, I won't breathe in near fish counters. And I only went in the sea, like for the first time properly, a couple of years ago. And, and it was like two days before my holiday ended and I fell in love with it. And I was like, I wasted my whole holiday not going in the sea. And then I wouldn't leave the sea. And then I was like, what's a song you secretly love to blast out when you're on your own? Well, I love Britney, but I do that when I'm not on my own. I love Britney. <laughs> I've met Britney. She sent me a letter afterwards because she's sweet like that and I will be Team Britney to the end. I love Queen. I like old school 90s pop. I love Rihanna, but I, I, I'm not ashamed of listening to any of the music that I like. I'm not ashamed of any of my music choices. I don't think anyone should be ashamed and I can't stand people who make you feel ashamed of your music choices, so yeah. What's one of your biggest pet peeves? Um, people who make you feel ashamed of your music choices. Um, I've talked about this in the past, but people that eat with their mouths open. Yeah, I, it's not just a pet peeve, it makes me want to rip my head off. Um, people that touch their neck, as I talked about in my previous video, it's a thing. It's not just kind of a pet peeve. It's to do with my um, OCD and it triggers images in my head, so it's not healthy for me. Noises, I'm, there, there are noises I can't stand. It's actually, it's, you know, it's, it's a physical thing. It, it makes me want to retch and vomit. What's one of your nervous habits? Twiddling my earrings. I do that a lot. And picking the skin off my lips. I get in trouble for that. What side of the bed do you sleep on? Kind of in the middle, I guess. I sleep on a double on a double duvet and it kind of wriggles around because I can't sleep on the mattress because it hurts too much. So I kind of, whichever, wherever my duvet is, basically. What was your first stuffed animal and what was its name? It was called Wo-Wo and it was like a little dog, but he was stolen when I went on a school trip 
by the girls that were bullying me that I was that I stayed in their room with and he was thrown into the sea. What's the drink you always order at Starbucks? Well, I don't go to Starbucks, so, um, but if I go somewhere, I would, I guess I, I get a green tea um, with a little bit of skim milk and guaranteed the person behind the counter would always go, you having milk in your tea? And I'm like, yes, because it tastes nice, so shut up. What's the beauty rule you preach but never practice? Don't pick your spots, I guess. I don't preach it, you shouldn't do it, but everyone does. Which way do you face in the shower? Well, I can't shower because I can't stand up, so I sit on the shower floor, run a little bit in the bath, and then I just shower. Do you have any weird body skills? As I said about the whole foot hair brushing thing, I guess that would be kind of weird. That's it. Oh, this is a horrible question. What's your favourite comfort food that's bad, but you love to eat it anyways? Um, super noodles with sweet corn and cheese and ketchup. Oh. Obviously I eat the low fat super noodles. Here's a tip, I should just say, eat whatever flavour super noodles you want, but the fat is in the actual noodles. Because there's only like two flavour super noodles that are low fat. And if you get the flavouring out of any of the other super noodles, then you can have whatever flavoured low fat super noodles you want. Shut up Charlotte. But I haven't had that in like ages. What's a phrase or exclamation you always use? When I'm editing my videos, I say um, or basically a hell of a lot. So I guess I would have to say that. Um, um, um. But in real life I'd say fuck. They're probably my most used phrases. Oh no, my hiccups have come back. Time to sleep, what are you actually wearing? Whoever wrote these questions is a bit of a filthy fucker. Um, I sleep in um, just a t-shirt and just some fleecy trousers because I'm sexy like that. So those are all the random questions. So these are the Disney ones. A scene in any Disney movie you wish you could experience? Well, I have always wanted to fly, and because he's hot, I guess I would probably say a whole new world magic carpet scene with Aladdin, um, because I think that would be really cool. An unforgettable experience or moment you've had at the parks? Probably when I was two, going up to Donald Duck and kicking him in the shin. Yeah, I did that. I'm sorry, Donald. What non-Disney songs remind you or bring back memories of Disney and or the parks? Probably Eternals album or PJ and Duncan because I got that when it was my birthday and we went on my 11th birthday. When was the first time you went to a Disney park? Um, when I was two. Um, as I've just said about my whole King Donald Duck experience. Again, I'm sorry. I don't know what was what was wrong with me. I do actually remember it because I remember things when I was like really, really tiny because I'm weird like if that. If you could choose any of the characters to be your best friend, who would you choose? Um, Genie from Aladdin because I think he's really cool. Who are your favourite Disney princesses? Ariel and Jasmine. And Belle, yeah. Name a scene or moment in any Disney movie that never fails to make you cry. Part of, part of your world, Little Mermaid. I wanna be where the people are. I wanna see, wanna see them dancing. Walking around on those, what do you call them? Feet. I can just relate to that song. Just the whole kind of, I want to be out there living. And not just because of the whole walking thing. It's always been um, just kind of looking out on people living. What is the first Disney movie you remember seeing? Um, Probably one of the older school, like Bambi or Sleeping Beauty, I remember earlier. But actually one that I remember really, really enjoying and engaging with is Little Mermaid. Um, or the three that I really, you know, the three were Little Mermaid, Beauty and the Beast and Aladdin that were kind of, were when I got hooked. But like Sleeping Beauty, Cinderella and 
I didn't like Bambi, I still don't. Um, they were kind of, I remember them earlier, but really the ones that hooked me and got me engaged were those three. What is your favourite Disney movie? Um, tied between Aladdin and Little Mermaid. Um, probably more Little Mermaid. We have to get the pug picture. We do. We do. We do. The pug. There's always got to be pugs. Well, there's always pugs in my videos because they're you cool. Have to, you have to keep that pug. I'll keep this pug behind my back. I'll okay. have to leave it. Oh, do you think that's Chloe coming up? What's your favourite Disney film? Um, Elsa and Anna. Elsa and Anna. Chloe, what's your favourite Disney film? Elsa. Elsa and Anna. We're no, up. not Elsa. You, you, do you want to show your frozen dress? And who got you the frozen dress? Did I get you the frozen dress? What other Disney yeah. films do you like? I wanna be where people are. I wanna see, wanna see. We like yeah. singing that song, don't we? Yeah. That is, that's our little song, don't we? Isn't it? Sometimes it's... I'm really good at it because my voice turns really like a lady voice. It does. Well, it's all your voice is always really good. Still. I do the Ursula one, don't I? Poor unfortunate souls. Is that your favourite song? It's one of my favourite songs, yeah. Do you like Ariel more? I, I do like Ariel more. She's I think she's my favourite Disney the princess. The Ariel song um, is better than her song because she's bad. She is bad. Mate. I want to hear you sing Let It Go. Can you do sing okay. Let It Go? The snow goes wide up the mountain tonight. Now the footprint to be seen. Yeah. I, I'm on your Elsa. I'm Elsa. No. No. Oh. I'm Elsa. No. Elsa. Oh. Do you, you want to build a snowman? And I love Frozen like that much. Not this much. Yeah. That much. Yeah, you couldn't that love it anymore. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. You probably love it more than you love chocolate. Do you love it more than you love biscuit spread? Yeah, say hi to all my followers. Say hi. Say hi. 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 Uh, Chloe, do um, you say hi? They're not saying anything. I like. No, they'll say um, they'll say something back, and I'll tell you what they say. Did you know there's gonna be there's gonna be another Frozen film? It's definitely there's gonna be another. I know, film. I know, I know, I know. Oh. It's the cartoon one, and and then it's um Frozen two, and it's. Um, on his birthday, and the only way to see it is go and watch the No, movie there's going to be another one. There's going to be a, a long film, a f long Frozen film. They've just announced it. Oh, that's oh. an excited face. Hello, I like you. I want to go with you. Da -da. Da -da. And Lily, you. and should we tell them, should we tell, should we tell YouTube about our super exciting girly weekend? We're uh, having a super exciting girly weekend. Lily's yeah, we're going, going to, to the shop. We're going to the shops and we're going to make pug cakes. And what else are we going to do? Mm, pick mix. Pick a mix. Lily's going to get a pick a mix. Uh, and and you, know, you can have some of my pick a mix. Can I have some of your? That's very kind yeah. of you. We have to share all the time, otherwise um, some people will get left left out. And you say bye YouTube. Bye YouTube. We just um, bye, bye YouTube. But, uh, just one more thing for you. Um. How does Frozen work? Okay, how does Frozen work, YouTube? How Frozen works? And how did you make it? I can't see Chloe. Okay, should we blow a kiss now? Love you. So, gotta be bye. bye bye. Bye. That's all the questions. Um, as I said, the reason I made this video is because I want to do a question and answer, so please leave your questions for me below or if you want to send them to me privately in a message then do. I'm not going to answer questions about weight and BMI because that's not appropriate. Um, somebody had a problem with me saying that. They left me a really rude comment, um, really nasty comment which I deleted but 
I think it's ridiculously inappropriate to talk about BMIs and weight um, and it's unhelpful so that's the only thing that I won't touch on because I want this channel to be helpful if I can. Um, if you like this video please give it the thumbs up, please subscribe and share and send me your, send me your comments, questions and if you have any ideas for videos then let me know. So thank you. Bye.